You can explore more of your favourite CBB shows on BBC iPlayer. In the cool morning air, all sorts of veggie sores emerge to start the day. Meet Ginger, mm. a young triceratops. Huh? <laughs> no way! It's a honeysuckle. <laughs> young triceratops are born with a sweet tooth. Oh, yeah. That's the good stuff. Hello? This is a P-Rex. It's hungry. The playful triceratops huh? will do nicely. <laughs> P-Rexes can detect the tiniest of vibrations. I can't see shh, any thing. <gasps> it's a chili peed. <gasps> Stop! Don't eat that! They're way too hot! But the baby P Rexes have their tummies set on this fast food. You can explore more of your favourite CBB shows on BBC iPlayer. It's a bok choy dactyl, a baby. It's become separated from its parents. Aww. Hi, I'm Ginger. <laughs> the peas are cautious. They know they're one of the bok choy dactyl's favourite foods. Oh, I know you're not going to hurt anybody. You're too little. <laughs> <laughs> that tickles. <laughs> Where are your parents, anyways? <laughs> Don't you know? <laughs> oh, I get it. You need to fly back to them. Hop on. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> <laughs> Broccoli saurus leave their habitat to drink from the lake. They're one of the largest vegasaurs and are true gentle giants. Whoa. Huh? Wait, what are you doing? Come back! You'll be squashed! Broccolisaurus allow P. rexes to exfoliate their skin, removing all the yucky bits. And in return... <laughs> Cucumber dials spend most of their time asleep. But when woken, it's always on the wrong side of the riverbed. <gasps> Split! Behind you! Not worth the fight. Stay out of sight. Hold on tight! <laughs> Do you want to play another game of hide? See? You have to make sure you stay really still, okay? Come on. You can explore more of your favourite CBB shows on BBC iPlayer. 
Ginger is trying to use the honeysuckle to enable flight. Say hello to the world's first flying triceratops. This breed of Vegasaur has never successfully taken to the air. Woohoo! We have Liftoff! Huh? Gravity wins again. <laughs> all right, all right. You think you can do a better job of flying? Yeah, 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 yeah. Stop, stop. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you rock! Way to go, Minty! <laughs> Minty, look out! <laughs> I know you're busy, but... I knew you would come. This place really rocks, generally speaking. Um, where are the others? Looks like Ginger has gotten her P-Rexes mixed up. This is not the Mama P-Rex she met uh -oh. before. Uh-oh, wrong team. The P-Rexes can't believe their luck. A sit-down meal. It's clear who's in charge here. The Mama P tells the pod that Ginger is a friend. Couldn't agree more. <gasps> Don't worry. I'll be able to slip out once it rains. Which should be any week now. <sighs> I can't believe I'm letting you do this. Remember, stay together and stick to the plan. Oh. <laughs> 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 Banana raptors are territorial by nature. If the P. rexes are discovered, they'll be captured and no doubt devoured. <laughs> oh no. Yeah! Way to keep warm! Majestic and rock hard creature is a coconut dog. Let's try bouncing off them. Yeah. An unusual phenomenon in the Vegisaur Valley is the skin of the pineapple sauce, which illuminates when struck. <laughs> Ooh, let's see if we can light them all up at once. <laughs> Just one thing left to do now. Let's see who can bounce off all of them at once. It's an all you can bounce. You can explore more of your favourite CBB shows on BBC iPlayer. Uh oh. 
potato dogs are extremely territorial. <laughs> hey, um, mind kicking that back? Being instinctively possessive makes them keen followers of the finder's keepers rule. Uh, it's just the round thing under your foot? <laughs> Game on, huh? <sighs> The volcanic terrain is so hot, it could fry a bok choy dactyl egg. Baby P. Rex's sleep run, too. You know, out of ten, this night is like a one. Tops. Bullet! Wasabi! Minty! Where are you? <laughs> huh? Split! <gasps> Baby P. Rexes often talk in their sleep, too. Split! going into the spooky, scary jungle. <laughs> good news, they'll lead us to the good stuff. So much of the good stuff. <laughs> but it's getting dark and we could get lost. Oh. Hmm. Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. But we won't get lost if we leave a trail we can follow back and what better to leave as a trail than trail mix? Load up! Ready, trailblazers? Yeah. Let's go! Coconut dogs have one of the biggest roars. Wow, I think we've just started a roar. Even the sleepiest of vegisaurs can be encouraged to join a roll off. I really do need a warm air bath now. Maybe I need to rethink this. Huh? A coconut dog. When it sleeps, it's often mistaken for a very round rock. But when awoken, these giants stand at nearly 10 meters tall and have three enormous nostrils. <gasps> which make equally enormous sneezes. <laughs> Triumph at last. You can explore more of your favorite CBB shows on BBC iPlayer. <laughs> With a top speed of 50 kilometers per hour and the weight of a small car, 
when a young Triceratops decides to butt heads, it's best to get out of the way. But even Ginger is no match for nectar fossilized in amber. <laughs> when we get this open, you have got to try it. Encased in hardened tree sap, fossilized nectar gains complexity and concentration over time, making it the yummiest snack in all of Vegisaur Valley. But it's a snack that's rarely enjoyed. The older the sap, the harder it is to crack. Most Vegisaurs would just give up. But Ginger and the young P. rexes are not most Vegisaurs. Bingo! Sun blossoms. Mm. The sun blossoms' orange petals are rich mm. in vitamins and make Triceratops coats mm. extra vibrant. Minky, mm. you're missing out. <gasps> it's an apple of flyers. Ginger has disturbed this one by mistake. Oh, sorry, I didn't see you. Ow! Sensing a threat, its instinct is to sting Ginger. It's <laughs> so itchy. <laughs> It's the Sunday roast, the day potato dogs bathe in mineral-rich springs and stretch out to dry on volcanic rocks, leaving their fins hot, crispy, salty, and delicious. You haven't lived until you've licked a hot fin. But if we want to get close, we will need a... Huh? Plan. Wait for me! The salt covering them is high in essential minerals and irresistibly delicious to a variety of vegisaurs. But potato dons are low in patience. Cornosaurolophus. It has become separated from its herd. When a Cornosaurolophus feels threatened or frightened, it sheds kernels, which creates the smell of freshly popped corn. You've got nothing to fear. But let's just get rid of these before the irresistible smell attracts the wrong attention. <laughs> Hmm. Let's play sit down, close your eyes, and don't move. Do you love sea babies? Well, you can learn, sing, and explore with all your favourite sea babies friends, like Number Blocks, Mr. Tumble, Bluey, Jojo and Grand Grand, and so much more. Why not ask your grown-up to download the BBC iPlayer app, where you can watch all your favourite CBeebies friends anytime, any way you like. <laughs>